Hello, I'm Semily Sherry of Triple Moon and in this clip I just wanted to have a quick word about manifesting which is very very important for all of us um, as we're trying to create a better future for ourselves and everyone around us and it's something that I kind of understood with my head for a while um, but it's only recently that the reality of how to do it has finally dawned on me um, and that is that you can't just do it with your thoughts and with your head and just holding a thought or an affirmation that doesn't work you have to really feel it in here um, as a rather wonderful lady called Kumari explained thoughts are electrical and feelings are magnetic so you kind of set the circuit off running, you set the energy off running with your thoughts and with your head, but the way to attract what you're trying to manifest to you is through your heart here, is through your feelings. And everything is energy, as we know, and like attracts like. It's that lovely saying, birds of a flat birds of a feather flock together and it's so true and so you can only draw to you that thing that you want if you're vibrating at that same level and so often of course our feelings are completely in contradiction to what we're wanting to manifest because we often have feelings of um, unworthiness that we don't deserve something that something is far beyond us if that's for other people that we can never have that thing um, that we want and so before you even start off on your manifestation journey you have to get yourself emotionally into a space where you're vibrating on the same level as that which you want to draw towards you and so that's the key that I found just after Christmas um, I was wanting to shift my business around a bit, um, focus more on a different kind of work and attract clients in for that. Um, and what I found was I could only get so far with it um, and I would have the idea and it would all be um, wonderful, I'd think yes, yes, that's what I want and then for some reason I couldn't go ahead with it, I couldn't manifest the detail and the structure for how to make this happen. And that was because I was still harboring uh, feelings of unworthiness, feelings of, it was lack of self-confidence, I suppose, lack of valuing myself and my work. And so I couldn't possibly attract that energy into me and so consequently I wasn't able to go anywhere with it. So what I did was I shifted my attention to raising my, by raising my vibration by changing the way I felt about myself. So I did a lot of work on self-esteem, um, on really connecting in with the frequency and vibration of the highest vibrations like love, gratitude, um, compassion for self most importantly as well as for others um, and what I found was I suddenly almost without me realizing I got into that state of feeling and I woke up one morning and I had the complete inspiration of exactly what to do um, and I updated my website, I put things out on social media and immediately I was there almost without thinking about it but it was because I had aligned myself emotionally with what I was trying to manifest and it became clear to me then just how vital it is, you just can't do it without that um, and as I said often we're, we're prevented from doing that because of our lack of self-worth self -worth. so I recently uploaded to YouTube a meditation called a meditation for self-appreciation and that just helps you to get into that space of loving yourself, of appreciating yourself and that raises your vibration and then immediately you can start attracting to you the thing that you're wanting to bring in because you are now vibrating at the same level and so you're birds of a feather and you can draw that dream, that job, that house, whatever it is, you can draw it towards you from your heart, from the magnetism of your heart. So I know this is a very obvious thing and too often we know it with our head but not with our hearts and so I just thought it was worth doing this video to remind you um, and obviously you can go to YouTube and listen to my meditation for self-appreciation to get yourself into that space before you start 
putting out your manifestation signals. And I hope that helps you.